This video has been sponsored by Honey. Oh God, nothing going on here. Big strong man. And welcome to another video. My name is Joe from Romy Official. Today, we're gonna to be looking at the best and most impressive vocals from The Voice. Sorry for the cringe intro, by the way. <laughs> so yeah, I wanted to do this video because recently we've been looking at a lot of like meltdowns from talent shows and embarrassing moments from talent shows in different videos. So today, why not be a bit positive? Why not focus on the really, really good performances? And as always, break it down, talk about what makes these things difficult. Talk about stylistic choices, all these beautiful things, and just listen to some good singing from talent shows. I feel like it's been a while since we did that, so yeah. We are on Best of The Voice, Top 10 Hardest Songs to Sing in the Blind Auditions of The Voice. Let's do it. Okay, so here we have Diana Ruvas singing Vision of Love by Mariah Carey. Mariah Carey, if you're new here, is of course known for her amazing, amazing vocals and range and songs that are so difficult she can't even sing them herself a lot of the time. Let's listen to Diana do it. Tweet and make She's already shown so much vocal control. That beautiful, beautiful head voice singing. If you knew her, by the way, head voice is what she kind of flipped into here. Like when it goes to that little bit softer thing. Sweet destiny. It's beautiful. I've realized a dream. Oh, beautiful. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, goosebumps everywhere. She's amazing. Oh, the runs, the tone. It's so impressive. It's not robotic. Like a lot of very talented singers with great technique will kind of end up sounding like there's not a lot of emotion going on in there, in my personal opinion. But this is really, this feels raw. I love this so much. Diana, what a princess. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't seem to like it super much there. <laughs> it was a little bit grating and a little bit pitchy. Maybe, but you can't be too <laughs> crazy about like crazy freaking whistle notes like that. You can't be like, oh yeah, no, it's it's 20 cents off. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> That's crazy! Oh, oh, it was beautiful. Like, just stuff like how she was exactly on the note, on the long E vowel there, and then the way she slowly, slowly let the vibrato loose on that note. You can really hear how controlled that is. Unbelievable. <laughs> Goosebumps everywhere. It's like I forget that these moments exist in talent shows because the things that get shared around the most, at least that I see, is often the really embarrassing stuff. But there are moments like this. It's crazy. Having a voice like this doesn't necessarily mean you'll be the best artist ever. There's so much more to being an artist and having your own specific style and everything. But admiring a voice for its own right. I love it. I think it's amazing. I'm not sure if I'll be able to handle this emotionally. How many times can you have goosebumps in like a short period of time before you faint? Stone cold. Stone Cold. Okay, so yeah, this is Stone Cold, the uh, Demi Lovato song. Also really, really difficult. Many fast runs and stuff. Big registry. If she nails this, it'll be amazing. You see me standing, but I'm dying on the floor. Stone Cold. Brooke Simpson. Stone Cold. Maybe if I don't cry, I won't feel it. <laughs> Miley just like, oh, someone else pushed the button. I'm also pushed the button. <laughs>
She seems to be pushing a little bit hard. It's still amazing, but sounds like she's kind of falling out of control just slightly every once in a while. Her energy is amazing. Goosebumps! I'm happy. Yeah! <laughs> Miley shouts up. Ah, that's beautiful. I've never heard a yeah like that one from Miley. It sounds so incredibly insincere. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> that could be a meme. <laughs> the way her eyes are like dead and just the mouth just goes, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. A little bit nervous, I think. Sounds like she has great control, but a little bit too much energy going into it. But it was also amazing that she had that amazing energy. Like when she belted that stuff and like her whole body was kind of moving with it here. That was amazing. That. Oh my god, I'm not gonna be able to deal with this video. I have too many goosebumps. Jesus. Oh. Sometimes I feel like it is the imperfection and like the overly just pushing in so much emotion into something that really takes a performance to another level. She obviously has amazing technique in the bottom of this, but the way she did it was just, oh, I think that really helped with the goosebumps. And that, ladies and gentlemen, leads me into today's sponsor, Honey. Online shopping is supposed to be easy, right? Especially now in these times where many people are stuck inside. Why is it so hard to find coupon codes that work? Well, today's sponsor, Honey, is a free online shopping tool that helps you find promo codes and applies them to your cart. So, Joel, I hear you ask with your sultry voice, how does Honey work? Well, imagine you're shopping of one of your favorite sites like eBay or Domino's. When you check out, this beautiful box appears and all you have to do is click apply coupons, wait a few seconds while it scans for promo codes all across the internet, and bam, you have saved money. You've saved your dollar. Look at this. I just bought an Xbox $100 digital gift card. What's that gonna cost, you ask? Maybe $100 for a $100 Amazon gift card? Wrong! With Honey, it only cost me $90 for $100 Amazon gift card. How does that even work? I don't know, but I'm so happy I used Honey, okay? It feels funny to save money with Honey. And I mean funny in a good way. Honey have saved their members only over two billion dollars. Billion! And Honey supports over 30,000 stores online. Honestly guys, if you don't have Honey installed, you're missing out on free money. Honey is free to use and installs in only two clicks. I'm just on joinhoney.com slash roomy and I click add Honey and add to Chrome. It's easy. You can also install it for free over at joinhoney.com slash roomy. It is literally a no-brainer. Installing it helps you guys, it helps me and my team. We all win. Joinhoney.com slash roomy. Thanks Honey for sponsoring this video and let's continue. Party girls don't get hurt, can't feel anything. When will I learn? Push it down, push it down. I'm the one for a good time, cold phones blowing up. I don't know how I feel about this so far. A little bit pitchy merch here, by the way. A little bit pitchy merch. Selling out fast. <laughs> a guy singing a Sia song. It can't work, of course. I just not entirely convinced so far. Maybe he's nervous. That falsetto's nice. That's awesome. How high is that? It's like, from the chandelier. It's high. Like, he pushes pretty hard. It sounds really good. Like, it really does. <laughs> he looks really... He doesn't look like he likes it, Will I Am. They have a tendency in these shows to just look like they kind of want to die. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like his dog just died or something. It's just really sad looking. Keep my glass full until my life. Cause I'm just holding on for tonight. 
I would say I was more impressed technically by the other ones, but this was really good as well. No goosebumps in this one, sadly. I'm hoping for a male goosebump moment as well. I've had two female goosebump moments. I feel like we're losing out. Guys out there, of course, we gotta make this about gender. I'm joking around, guys, okay? It's a, it's a joke, but I do want to see a male singer do well too. That would be great. Just He's so distinctive looking, this guy. I don't know what it is. It's something about the jawline, I think. He's got like a normal haircut, normal like a little bit of stubble, but he just looks so like, I could pick him out of a lineup immediately after seeing him for like five seconds and I don't know what it is. He's so distinctive looking, that's crazy. <laughs> Tom Jones just <laughs> chilling there. <laughs> It's like Dave said in another video the other day. Like Tom Jones, just it's just a joke whenever you see him. And I don't know why it is. He's got that pitbull quality to him. Dale. Even though he is a great singer. Like he's not like a joke when it comes to, you know, his singing voice or like the way he can sing. But he makes me so happy. Just <laughs> Tom Jones. He's so obviously happy. Nice! Little goosebump vibe. That was awesome. The way he was moving, he felt like some comedian. Like Ben Stiller or something doing a singing role in a movie, like comedy movie. There was something a little bit funny about it. I liked it. He seemed super likable. Something I've noticed about a lot of these hard songs to sing is that they're all ballads, right? I don't think ballads are that hard to sing. What they are is that they're actually easier to sing. There's less going on generally in ballads, meaning that you can do more vocal runs and stuff without kind of messing with it. I would say that it's probably often more hard technically to be like on pitch and on rhythm and everything in faster songs, but vocals can really shine in a ballad, so, you know. I know that when you look at me, nice. there's so much that you just don't see. Perfect pitch. Oh my god. You know how like it went to like a point where I'm like, oh my god, this is so impressive. I'm like getting goosebumps. And then she went like even higher. Oh, my brain. My brain, I need to hear that again. It's not even about how high the note is. I, I mean, partly it is, but it's also like the tone and like the dynamics of it, the way she did it. So good. Oh. Uh, bruh. <laughs> uh, uh, no. Oh, God. Nothing going on here. Big strong man. Big strong man not doing anything. Oh, my God. Oh, okay. <laughs> I told myself I would never do this on camera again. Okay, stop it. Isn't it crazy that music can do that? Kimberly Joy. Freaking unbelievable. I'm such a big fan of that type of like gospel type singing as well. Some of my musician friends recommended this one artist to me when I was younger. It is really good, but he sings really funny. His name is Michael McDonald. He sings like, oh. 
<laughs> Stupid sounding, really dopey sounding, right? He's an amazing singer though. I thought it was alright, but then on this one song, he had this guest gospel singer on, and it's just unbelievable. I, I just want to play you guys a little bit of it because this is some life changing stuff for me. <laughs> This woman, I don't even know who she is, but she changed my life. Like she made me so much more passionate about singing. Ah, oh, that's a nice run too. Ah, oh, bro, I love music, man. What is this video even gonna be? It's so messy. B R B. Okay, I'm back. So yeah, I forgot everything about what just happened. No nothing weird happened. Forgotten all about it. Partial amnesia. Let's keep going. Who are these people? Two guys in this chair. Okay, I know what this is. Interesting. Wait, what? Was that on purpose? What? What's going on? It was really cool, I guess, but also like kind of when your headphones break type thing. What's going on? What happened? And then she had an amazing voice, like super much control. She must have done it on purpose, surely. It sounded like one of those troll YouTube singers are like, oh yeah, I'm going to sing cover blah, blah, blah. <laughs> you know, that type of thing. But in this context, I guess it's cool. If she does that again, I'm going to freak out. What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Me. <Meh. laughs> That's literally something I would do in a video, but not about this. <laughs> ah, that distortion is delicate, beautiful. That was so cool! Oh, it was like kind of like screamo type stuff and she kind of took it up high up in the registry. I've never really heard that before. I wonder if it really hurts her voice or something, but like she seems like she has a lot of control. That's so cool. I don't know if it is like pop star compatible or anything, but that is cool. Okay, so click here for more music commentary videos. Click here for videos where I sing or make music. And click here for videos specifically chosen for you by the YouTube algorithm. This was a crazy video. I loved every second of it. This has been amazing. This has been unreal. Thank you guys for being here. I'll see you tomorrow in another daily video. <laughs> Bye.